I went to Lubbock, Texas a couple weeks ago, did a Nephilim conference out there. Gonna go out there to talk about giants and stuff, right? I get out there and this, this older gentleman takes me outside and he says, and if you've ever been to Lubbock, you can understand why like this entire church are flat earthers. Because every direction you look, it's like flat. He took me outside at night and he had one of these. This is a Centec infrared thermometer. You basically point it at something, it's got a, a laser and it tells you the color temperature in Celsius or Fahrenheit. So right now this screen is 73.4 degrees. So he says, let me show you something. It was a half moon outside, nice bright half moon, clear night, and the moon is shining down on the building, casting a shadow on the parking lot. So he tests the shadow and it was like 40 degrees, let's say. He goes, now let me show you something else. Went a few feet over where the shadow had ended and we're looking at direct moonlight and it was 30 degrees. The shade of the moon. So that's the shade. In the shade, it's 39 degrees. And then you go to the moonlight, and you got 32. 32. Wow. Mm -hmm. Or 33. 32, 33. Is it more dramatic when it gets darker? It seems to be more dramatic when the moon is fullest. So the moon, like a full moon, like the fullest in a completely moon, dark night, sometimes 12 degrees. 12 degrees. So yeah. the, the more full the moon is, the cooler it is. It seems to be. It's a half moon right now. I mean, <laughs> don't ask me why, because I don't know, but I know it works every time I've tried it, everywhere I've tried it. Went over to my 85-year-old uncle's house and did it in his front yard, and he made me go buy him one. <laughs> <laughs> it was colder in the direct moonlight than it was in the shadow of the moon. Now, when you go outside and test direct sunlight and then test the shadow, the shadow is about 10 to 20 degrees cooler. It's the exact opposite. This is called empirical evidence. This is it's called science, where you can actually do testable, observable, repeatable you know, things, observations. Now, we're all told that the moon is a reflector of the sun. How does that work? If the moon is literally giving off cold light that's warmer in the shadows cast by the moonlight. I don't know. I'm still asking questions. <laughs>